Hi guys, we're doing your weekly reading for love. I'm gonna do it with each element. I'll make this very, very fast. So, each element with your sign, if you're dating each of those, hopefully not. <laughs> not all those elements, right? And then a secret revealed by the oracle. Okay, um, I'm Sal and I wish you guys well for, for this weekly reading and I'll see you again. And if you guys need a personal reading, link down below. Here we go. Hi Aries, we're doing your weekly love reading where um, this time we're going to do it again based on the elements. So first element that we're doing is the earth sign. Okay, the earth sign we're going to ask the question, what are they thinking and then why and how it's affecting you and then um, the oracle to unlock the secret. Okay, so let's see what we have for Aries dealing with an earth sign. What are they thinking? Aries dealing with an earth sign. Okay, mm, past life connection. So you have here Aries is a uh, six of cups. This is an emotion or a past person who's coming towards your life again. So they're resurfacing. It can be a soulmate. Um, also, what are they thinking? They're thinking of reconnecting with you. <laughs> That's what they're thinking. Okay. Why are they thinking this? Why? Oh, because they can. The chart here, it's about like they, they have finally probably found themselves and now they are coming back towards the direction of, you know, of, of you. If you're dating, okay, I feel here for a single, someone from the past is coming back again, hence you're single, and then they're charging with you. If you are a couple, I strongly feel here Six of Cups is just uh, emotional, uh, not emotional fulfillment, but you guys are very, very balanced. And you guys are moving towards the next, uh, next, um, uh, what to call it? next stage of being in a relationship but let's see now what is um how does this make an Aries feel with the connection with an earth sign okay you have here nine of ones um you have uh, probably have certain goals and dreams that you are looking after this is you expecting something that is uh, you know coming towards your way now that is uh, for the earth sign that you are dealing with all right Aries so let me see what is a secret for this week I told you past people even though you're a couple this is all about memories resurfacing okay so that is the first one that we have for the element we have next we have the palace of cups which is for the water sign so Aries dealing with water sign let's see Aries dealing with water sign what are they thinking what are they thinking if you are dating single or couple it still applies let me see Aries what are they thinking Hmm, okay, now it's six of pentacles. So if you're single, you're thinking like, okay, I've done enough. Like I'm, I'm very, very work. I worked out myself to be okay. And if you're, if you're a couple, um, I feel here that you are just seeing. It's like okay, like things has been cool. Things has been, um, where it's supposed to. Let's see what. Oh, Aries. Okay, so I think either you are, if you're dealing with the water sign, single. Okay, they're probably uh, helping you heal because this Lee, uh, this this strength card is all about healing. So there's someone that you're meeting or someone you are with, um, is helping you heal and go through a stage of, of basically life. So a very very nice person that you are with, Aries, as far as the, the cups, which is you know like they're very caring and natural. Um, how is it affecting you? It's helping you maintain your balance and focus. So single, you're probably having the passion again with regards to to work and life because this is about earth energy. So you are probably f uh, finding yourself again driven and more uh, productive. This Eight of Pentacles is all about producing and watching it grow. Now, let's see what is the secret. Uh, that applies also for the couples. It's giving you the new life, whoever you are with, because they're helping you cope. The secret that needs to be revealed okay very interesting so be careful because some t someone if you're single might not be who they are or they're probably just wearing a mask now the mask is duality it means they're probably hiding also in pain or also hiding secrets so just be very careful on that part whoever you're dealing with uh, uh with the cups all right now next we have is the fire sign fire sign to fire sign let's see how's the aries dealing with the fire sign Aries dealing with a fire sign. Let's see. Aries dealing with a fire sign. Aries. Okay. Aries dealing with a fire sign. 
what are they thinking oh they're uh, so okay a uh, single whoever you're meeting or you are with dating um they're waiting for you to reply or you're waiting for them to come to you this is a judgment um for the couples you are allowing the benefit of the doubt with your partner maybe they have done something wrong or karmic mm -hmm. two <laughs> two cards already here that are major arcana so yes you are waiting for something to come to fruition single because wheel of fortune is in your your um in your cards so things will start to turn around this week and it's going to move towards the direction of uh whatever you put in it's going to come back to you you. same thing for couples if you're listening to your partner they're gonna come in towards your direction of uh, that judgment okay let me see okay you have your page of swords some people are going away on a trip also this uh, source is also about your, the thoughts the thoughts that you have with this person single it's a little bit not so clear because emotions is not involved it's more of the of the um, mental uh, connection okay so very very mental connection not mental connection but i mean yeah mental connection you have but in an intellectual way now let me see what is the secret that is going to be revealed for the iris dealing with another fire sign mm-hmm okay so i see here that um a lot of work has been uh that you're gonna go through this week and you're gonna maintain your balance this is you and you but however you are not being helpful to whoever you are with if you're a couple because you are weighing down someone <laughs> oh, very very interesting um next we have here for the air sign so iris dealing with an air sign let's see iris dealing with an air sign let's see i'm just gonna shuffle this Make sure that everything is okay. I was dealing with an air sign. What are they thinking? What are they? Okay, uh, they're thinking of a new beginning with you. They want something, uh, you know, to manifest this week, or you want to manifest something with this uh, this week with the swords. Oh, very nice magician because it can happen so fast and so quick, and you don't even know. For the couples, uh, the, uh, maybe you just got coupled uh, past week, and now you think like nothing is impossible, and everything in the world is like you can basically control and you know be on top of the world. The magician is all about having the skills and the energy, and you know basically a doer card. All right. Now, okay, mm, interesting. You have Knight of Swords here as how it is affecting you. You feel that this is going too fast or too risky because there is no, uh, not that there's no red flags. There are red flags, but you have ignored it with this with this um, air sign. Be very careful because the person can have that energy of, can, they can do anything. So, and this is a person, Knight of Swords here, they will go to any, uh, any doors without reading what is the sign, all right? So that is going to be for, the air uh, aries dealing with all different elements my name is sal i'll see you again link down below for a personal reading bye wait don't go it resonated right so why don't you book a reading down there or up or wherever it is or if it didn't resonate you should be you should be checking your sun moon rising or sometimes even your venus sign okay so i will see you in your appointment bye